About the author. Venerable Atsariya Mahabua Nyarna Sampano is himself an outstanding and distinguished figure in contemporary Thai Buddhism. He is well known and respected by people from all walks of life for his impeccable wisdom and his brilliant expository skills. By aptitude and temperament, he is the ideal person to record for posterity Atsariya Man's life and teachings. Spiritually, he is one of Atsariya Man's exceptionally gifted disciples. Didactically, he is one of the Dutanga tradition's truly masterful spokesmen. His no-nonsense, resolute character, his extraordinary charisma, and his rhetorical skills have established him as Atsariya Man's natural successor. Born in 1913 in the northeastern province of Udon Thani, Atsariya Mahabua was ordained as a Buddhist monk in 1934. Having spent the first seven years of his monastic career studying the Buddhist canonical texts, for which he earned a degree in Bali studies and the title Maha, he adopted the wandering lifestyle of a Tutanga monk and set out to search for Atsariya Man. Finally meeting up with him in 1942, he was accepted as a disciple and remained living under his tutelage until his death in 1949. In the period following Atsariya Man's death, Atsariya Mahabua, by then fully accomplished himself, soon became a central figure in efforts to maintain continuity within the Dutanga Gammatana fraternity and so preserve Atsariya Man's unique mode of practice for future generations. He helped to spearhead a concerted attempt to present Atsariya Man's life and teachings to an increasingly wide audience of Buddhist faithful. Eventually, in 1971, he authored this biography to showcase the principles and ideals that underpin Tutangakam Martana training methods and inform their proper practice. By 1960, the world outside the forest came to exert a significant impact on the Tutanga tradition. The rapid deforestation of that period caused Tutanga monks to modify and eventually curtail their wandering lifestyle. As the geographic environment changed, teachers like Atsariya Mahabua began establishing permanent monastic communities where Dutanga monks could conveniently carry on Atsariya Man's lineage, striving to maintain the virtues of renunciation, strict discipline, and intensive meditation. Practicing monks gravitated to these forest monasteries in large numbers and transformed them into great centers of Buddhist practice. At Wat Ba Bantad, Atsariya Mahabua's forest monastery in Udon Thani, a religious center arose spontaneously, created by the students themselves, who came for purely spiritual motives in hopes of receiving instruction from a genuine master. In the years that followed, the many Western monks who came to Atsariya Mahabua were able to share wholeheartedly in this unique religious experience. Some have lived there practicing under his tutelage ever since, helping to spawn an international following which today spans the globe. Highly revered at home and abroad, Atsariya Mahabua remains to this day actively engaged in teaching both monks and laity, elucidating for them the fundamental principles of Buddhism and encouraging them to practice those bold and incisive techniques that Atsariya Man used so effectively. Like Atsariya Man, he stresses a mode of practice in which wisdom remains a priority at all times. Although ultimately pointing to the ineffable mysteries of the mind's pure essence, the teaching he presents for us is a system of instruction that is full of down-to-earth practical methods suitable for everyone desiring to succeed at meditation. Studied carefully, it may well offer direction to persons who otherwise have no idea where their practice is taking them.